All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. We are here once again with Sugar Rush as it is Saturday. It is time for Sugar Rush Saturday. How many of you were surprised to see Sugar Rush today? Raise your hands, put your hands down. You all knew it was coming. This is what we do here every Saturday on the channel. We play Sugar Rush and we're gonna see, see if we can spin our way into a good sized bonus here using our free gold coins here. So we get 20,000 coin bonus by if we can get into it, which would be fantastic. Even if it doesn't pay real well, at least it would be nice to get into one. In the event, however, that we don't spin into one, we're going to go ahead and buy into our own bonuses here. Make our own fun. Hopefully our own wins as well. I appreciate you taking the time to watch the video and joining me here. Thank you all for choosing to spend a little bit of your day here. And again, as always, if you are new here or if you are a returning viewer who's been here dozens of times and you are not yet subscribed, I do upload every single day, so I would appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button down below. It really does actually help the channel out in the long run. Uh, plus, you get rewarded with daily videos, especially if you turn on that notification bell so you don't miss any one that happens. I upload every single day at 8 a.m. Eastern Time, unless I somehow hit the wrong button and mistakenly upload at midnight, which I have done from time to time. I am only human, and I will make mistakes. All right, we get a couple more spins here to see if we get into the bonus here. We'll start off at a 5,000 coin bonus by, however, to be able to uh, take care of our own business here and see if we can get a good win. I don't remember how the last session here went on Trigger Rush. It was almost a week ago, and uh, I have had a lot going on between last week and this week. So, don't remember a whole heck of a lot, but I do remember lots of re-triggers. For some reason, I think we got the last week was the moment we got just the, the whole mess of re-triggers and, and got a pretty good win out of it. Uh, so correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm fairly certain that is the case. I think we had like maybe three different games we got re-triggers on. Uh, and one of them we didn't even make a profit on, which was surprising. However, we're doing pretty good on this one. This one, we're opening up lots of multipliers. We got a good little background going there and not a lot of dead spins that does drop in the purple as well as the gold coming in from the top there. There we go. We got some 16 X's on the board now. Now a 32 X, which is about to become a 64 X. When we hit that top symbol hit there, that is going to put us up into our profit already here on this first buy. Still five spins left to go. That 64 X right there looming large in that top left area. Now we just need to need to drop something nice and big right on top of it. Doesn't even have to be huge, could be just bears, something. There we go. That's gonna make it the 128. So we do have a single 128 on the board. We have one spin to be able to hit it. Already almost a double up here. Final spin of the bonus is not a dead spin and it's actually pretty good. So that's gonna put us over 11,000 coins total for the bonus buy, which is more than a double up on the 5,000 that we started with. An excellent start for Sugar Rush. Let's see if we can keep that momentum going here. Uh, I would hate for that to be the best bonus of the video. And I'm not sure why I even said that out loud as to give myself the opportunity to jinx myself. You think I would have learned by now, but I guess I'll just never learn not to say things out loud like that. All right, this is not quite as promising as the last one, but it's active at least, which is really all I can ask for with half of these games is just something, something to happen at all on the screen. Nice to see the heart slide in there. Reds are not gonna connect, however, because the bears were connected by one too many. There we go, there's a nice middle of the board connection across everything, basically. That was most of the middle there. That was like eating the, the middle of a cinnamon roll. There's a nice, nice big tasty chunk out of the middle there. We are down to our last couple of spins here, so we're going to need a little bit of work here. Final spin. Final spin is a dead spin. 1792. Not nearly as good as the first game. So we're going to bump up here to a 6,000 coin bonus buy. See if we can recreate the magic from the first 5,000 coin one here. Sort of hoping maybe this is one of those videos where we win one, lose one, win one, lose one. But that first one's a really good win. If it's gonna make us dizzy with wins, it is okay, as long as it keeps giving us good ones to get dizzy with. 
Once again, lots of scatters popping up on the screen here, only one at a time, so not a lot of a threat of getting a retrigger, but just it's enough to keep an eye on. There we go, we got purple bears across. Can we get a red bear drop in on top of those two? No, we can't. That is a, a real, real shame that that one couldn't pull through. There we go, once again, back to making connections here with the purple bears. Final two spins, not a lot of multipliers up here on the board. We're gonna have to get one of those like big drops of hearts or, or something that didn't happen there. 435 coins. If you've watched enough of these videos, you know sometimes we'll get just a big drop of hearts or, or gumballs or um, jelly beans. Just a, a whole big group of them just drop down at once at the very end there to sort of save the bonus a little bit, but that was not the case on this one. We do, however, do get our retrigger, so hopefully we don't waste it on this one. We still have eight spins left to go on our original 10 spins, and then we'll worry about the retrigger spins after that, but let's build the board here for all of these extra spins to make usage of. I feel like that would be the smart thing to do. Not that I have a lot of control over it, but still I feel like it would be the smart thing to do if we even had the ability to control it. Let's go ahead and uh, open up multipliers. A lot of jelly beans there. Wish there were multipliers behind it, but there sure is now. Still have uh, four spins left on the original bonus here. Yeah, we're just trying to build those, those background multipliers as much as possible for the extra 10 spins that we got. All right, this is the final spin of our regular bonus, which would have been a terrible bonus had we just let that one play out and not got the extra spin, so I'm glad we did. Still not quite done yet. All righty. One more heart, maybe? Nope. Oh, yep, we got the heart. Didn't even see the heart drop in there. So we would have had a 4,104 coin bonus had we only had the original 10 spins, but now we have 10 extra spins to work with, so... Let's see what kind of damage we can do with this, with that 32 and 64x on the screen there. Nearly a second re-trigger there. Let's not dead spin all 10 spins, please. Let's make use of some of this. There we go. Does that give us red bears? It does. That's a lot of multipliers on those red bears, too. There's a couple of 64x's with a 32x now next to it. Only three spins left to go, but would be an ideal time to take advantage of them being there. <laughs> One more scatter on that. That might have been the end of the game. There we go. That was a nice hit there for 7,000 on those red, uh, red bears that came in there. We're still tumbling, though. This one is already a 300x win. Still have one spin left to go. 10,000 on that one spin alone. Final spin is not a dead spin. Not a real good one considering the screen we had, but almost 19,000 coins. And a 6,000 coin bonus buy. We're going to do one more 6,000 coin bonus buy here and see if we can get a recreation of that one as well. This is one of those times where the retrigger actually helped. Unlike the last video where we got a retrigger, it still lost spins. Uh, still lost coins on our spin. All in all, it's been a pretty pretty fun session. Had a lot going on. We had a couple of good wins. Hopefully this uh, this one here and uh, what will be the final buy after this one will not flop for us. But if it does, we've had a lot to watch and we've had a good time doing it. At least I've had a good time. I hope you have. Not a lot going on on this board at the moment. Unless we drop some more hearts in. Which we don't. Gumballs maybe. Nope, no extra gumball on that one either. Unlikely that we're going to get a second retrigger on this session here, so I'm not even looking for it. I always think it's very weird when we get just a stack of five in a in a you know end column. It just it looks it looks odd on the screen. I don't know why. 
maybe it's just me that thinks of it that way when it happens but it just it just visually is is a weird look 1185 on 6000 is not that great so we're gonna go up and do our 10,000 coin end of the video bonus buy here one way or the other uh, as far as I'm concerned it's been a win because again I've had a great time let's see if we can go ahead and finish on a hugely positive note here All right, two dead spins in a row is not what I would call hugely positive. I need to really turn that one around quick, start getting some connections here. I wish I could tell you that I'm uh, stunned into silence because of good things, but I am not. I am stunned into silence by the fact that we have 175 coins and we're on our final spin. Okay, 215 coins on 10,000 coins. Absolutely not happening. We're gonna do that one one more time. And this will for sure be the final buy regardless of how this one works out, good or bad. Even if we just get another 200 coins out of it, which I really, really hope is not the case. In the meantime, I thank you all very much for joining me here. If there's a game you wanna see me play, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to uh, like the video and subscribe if you're not yet subscribed. It really does help out in the long run here. And let's just go ahead and enjoy the last bonus by here on Sugar Rush of what has been a relatively entertaining session. I just didn't want to go out with a flop, but it looks like we might be doing it anyway. Never mind, we got a re-trigger on the final, final game here. Uh, so we are going to get another 10 spins, which is good because the first 10 didn't look like they were doing much of anything. So let's finish out the last four spins here of our regular bonus. See if we can get any more multipliers opened up for our bonus spins here. I really hope these bonus spins come through and do something for us because these first 10 haven't done anything. All right, here are our bonus 10 spins. Would have been a 305 coin bonus, which immediately would have been better than the last one, but that's not saying much. At least is it exciting enough to get the extra spins on the final bonus. More exciting, of course, if it pays out, but nice to see anyway. Little by little, it's it's adding up. It just might be too little at, at, at too late here. Just not getting the connections when we needed them. Lots of twos and fours, however, on the screen here. There is a single times 16 in the top right. It does drop down both stars and gumballs. This is honestly turning out far better than I thought it was going to. And we hit the 16x with the stars, making it a 32. That is nice to see. We have two spins left to go. Much, much better than this could have been. Again, this could have been that 340 coins. Yeah, as it turned out, the final spin is a dead spin. 69.80 is way better than we thought it was going to be. I'm going to go ahead and end it there. Thank you all very much for joining me, and you have yourself a wonderful evening, day, night, morning, whatever it happens to be for you, and I'll see you tomorrow.